If you guys are like me and you recorded in an untreated bedroom, you've probably ran into some of the issues that I have, which is getting some resonant frequencies, some harsh and boxy frequencies from your mix. And you've probably tried a lot of different things to fix those issues. But luckily for you guys, I'm gonna be showing you guys this new plugin that I found that helps so much with removing those frequencies. All right, so let's jump into FL Studio. I'm gonna show you guys this new project I'm working on, and then we're gonna show you guys the plugin and how it works. So if you haven't seen the last Yeet video I did, this is the project that I'm working on. So I'm just gonna show you guys what it sounds like if you haven't heard that yet. So this is what the plugin looks like. It's super simple. There's this big suppression knob, and this is just basically how much of those frequencies you're gonna be taking out. So if you really want to clean up the vocal, you're going to bring this up all the way. And if you don't want to mess with those frequencies too much, you could obviously bring it down. There's also a bunch of different presets you could use by clicking this button, going to presets, and you had just have a bunch of different stuff you could use here. So what I'm going to do is just go to the presets here and start with this clear male vocal. And we're just going to adjust it from there. So I'm going to solo out the vocal so we can hear what it's exactly doing. I don't make this shit up. I just straight up break the law. I step my braid up to the ceiling and I murder y'all. I got these bitches on my dick, but they just busting balls. Hold on, hold on, let's just talk about this fucking problem. I expect my money back. The way I like to use this plugin is to usually max it out. So I'm going to bring the intensity all the way up. And then I'll usually just use fresh air to bring in some more of those harmonics if it takes out too much. But another really cool part about this plugin is the mix assist, which is basically just AI. And it's going to make all the settings for you based off what your vocal actually sounds like. So we're going to click this, play the vocal. Yeah, my phone's off. Put that bitch on D and D, cause I don't talk to y'all. All right, so let's actually hear this in context with the beat. Yeah, my phone's on. Put that bitch on D and D, cause I don't talk to y'all. I don't make this shit up. I just try to break the law. All right, then here's what it sounds like with it off. Yeah, my phone's on. Put that bitch on D and D, cause I don't talk to y'all. Now, this is obviously something you need headphones for or studio monitors to really hear what it's doing, but it makes the vocals sit in your mix so much better. It's actually insane, and you don't have to do anything besides click the mix assist button. So I've been using this pretty much on every mix and master I've been doing, and it's really been clearing out my vocals. Now, a couple cool other features in this plugin is the frequency limit. So you can basically set what this is actually going to touch. So if you don't want it to touch the high end of your vocal, you could obviously just bring this down. Or if you don't want it to mess with the low end, you could also bring this up or down. You could also apply this to drums and 808s and stuff. Obviously there are some presets in here that says better 808s clean pads pianos there's a bunch of stuff you could do with it you could also put it on your mastering chain and that's what we're going to do here so i'm going to go over to my master and just add the m clarity plugin and we're just going to hit this mix assist again get my phones on put that bitch on dnd because i because i don't talk to y'all i don't make this shit up i just straight up break the law i'll step my bread up to the ceiling and i'm murder y'all so the main thing this plugin is really doing is just cleaning up any harsh frequencies and it uses AI to detect what's harsh and what isn't. So it does everything for you, but it's not just removing harsh frequencies. It's moving muddiness, boxiness, and you have to spend years and years of mixing and mastering to figure out what to actually remove. And this does it all for you. So if you guys head down to the description, I will have a link to get this plugin and it has a crazy deal right now. So I'm telling you guys, you should definitely go check that out. That's all I got for you guys right now. And I will see you guys in the next video. Deuces.